Hundreds of people filled our Savior's Lutheran Church in Sioux Falls to honor the life and legacy of former U.S. Senator Tim Johnson. Johnson, who served at the state and federal levels, never lost an election. His colleague in Congress, former U.S. Senator Tom Daschle, said Johnson navigated the nation's capital with grace, dignity, and a sense of humor. Daschle also called him a very special friend. I can't help regret that since leaving the Senate, our paths crossed far too rarely. We no longer had the daily contact we took for granted in those years we served in Congress together. And I, I take responsibility for that. On a day like this, I'm again reminded of the extraordinary value of maintaining friendships, even when distance makes it more challenging. Family was central to Johnson's life. His son spoke about who he was as a father and included some humorous stories, like their father's persistence for attending Sunday church. He had a rule. If you were too sick for church, you were too sick for TV. And <laughs> Pastor, I, I don't know about that correlation, but it pro proved to be a powerful deterrent, <laughs> right? But the Tim Johnson that I really want to remember here today is, is not the senator or the congressman, but the husband and the father. You know. Brooks Johnson says his father's endless determination and work ethic carried over into his family life. There was, there was never a break, never a, a time off, right? Or being too tired to be present, to be with his family, to let all of us know that we were loved. Johnson touched countless lives. Tim supported, advised, listened, laughed, and mentored staffers, constituents, younger leaders, family and friends. He seemed to have time and energy for every one of us, even when he's exhausted, even when he was stretched so thin. I've heard from so many of the tribal relatives, friends we've had, and what they've said is that they're leaving food out for your journey. So I think you must have meant a lot to a lot of people, Dad, and we love you. We'll miss you.